Hi guys, how are you all? I hope you all are doing okay. So guys, welcome to the another video on NRF BLE tutorial series. So today we will send the data through our smartphone and we can turn the LED on over BLE. Or we can attach a relay with some AC lights and we can control that as well. So without wasting any more further time, let's do this. So this video is brought to you by PCBGoGo.com and PCBGoGo is launching the greatest sale of the Christmas and Happy New Year. Every day PCBGoGo will choose one lucky person and that lucky order will be free of charge. Also they are offering biggest discounts coupon for this year up to $155. Visit the website and grab your discounts on this Christmas and New Year sale before it ends. And orders above $60 will receive gifts as well. So visit the link in video description to get these benefits. And new users will also get $50 off coupon. And one last thing, follow PCBGOGO on Twitter to get more Christmas giveaways such as Amazon gift card, PCBGOGO cash, etc. Find all the links in video description. So first make sure you have following things. One breadboard and an Arduino or any other equivalent board, one NRF24 LO1 RF module, some jumper wires and a resistor of 1 kilo ohm and one LED. If you don't have any of these stuff, please find all the buying links in video description below. Now coming back to our project, please make sure you have watched our old NRF BLE series videos in order to understand this one. If not, please find the links for the videos in card section and description below and watch them before going on with this one. Now after that, please follow the zone schematics and connect everything according to the schematics. And most importantly, as you can notice, I have connected the LED to pin number 7. You can connect one or more LEDs to any of the pins. But more LED means in our NRF app, we have to create two advertisement per pins. Which means one advertisement to turn it on and another to turn it off. So one pin will need two advertisement. So we will create two advertisement in NRF app for pin 7. And please make sure you have NRF app installed in your device. So after this setup, let's go to our PC and open Arduino IDE. Please download this sketch from video description. Now make sure you have installed these two libraries in your Arduino IDE. Then we created instances for RF and BTLE here. Now put your Bluetooth device name here, which you can find in your phone settings. As for me, it is OnePlus 7. Now in setup we started a serial communication and we started BTLE service as well. Now in loop we created a string to store the data and if BTLE will listen to an advertisement then it will convert the payload into characters and save the data in the string variable. Now after that we are checking if the string starts with our device name. And if it does, it will take the pin number from the second position character in the string. And then it will take the state of pin which could be 0 or 1 from the third position character from the string. So let's upload this code to our Arduino board. Now to set up the advertisement, we need to create an advertisement to turn on or turn off the LED in the app. In app, go to the advertiser section and click on add icon. Then write the name for your advertisement. As I will write it as pin 7 on. Then click on add record and add the complete local name of the device. Which will be your bluetooth name of your device. Then click again on add record and select manufacturer data. Then in 16 bit identifier type. 0107 
which means pin number will be the 7 and 1 will be the digital output. And in the data part, type 00. Then hit OK twice. Now to create pin 7 of advertisement, let's click on clone and let's clone this one and let's edit it now. Change the display name as off and in manufacturer data, instead of 0107, we will write 0007, which means pin number 7 will get 0 digital output. And then hit OK twice again. Now turn on the pin 7 on advertisement and then hit OK. And as you can see, we got output on the serial monitor and our LED is turned on as well. And similarly, we can turn our LED off by starting the pin 7 of advertisement. But make sure the other pin 7 on advertisement is off. And we can try this with AC output with relay instead of LED to make it look a bit cool. So similarly, you can have any number of outputs and you can have any number of advertisement. And this project is still under development. So you might face some issues. So please do let me know those in comment section and I will try to help you out. So guys, that's all for today. I hope you like this video. If you do, hit like, give me a share and don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys in another video of mine. Till then, keep exploring. Music